So shout out to all of you who made it to the St. Teresa of Avila retreat uh, this past weekend. I hope you're all richly blessed and it was wonderful to see so many people. Um, unfortunately, the recordings uh, didn't have proper sound. I apologize. Um, hopefully the next retreat I'll figure out how to get proper sound. I was hoping to put the talks on YouTube. I won't be able to do that. I apologize. Um, I just started reading about the apparitions of the Blessed Virgin Mary in Argentina, Our Lady of the Rosary of St. Nicholas. Uh, Blessed Mother has been appearing to um, a woman named Gladys since 1983. And these apparitions have just been approved by the church. And fascinating, fascinating stuff. Um, what's unique about these apparitions is that the Blessed Virgin Mary breaks open the scriptures in a way we've never seen before, it seems, in any other of her apparitions. Um, she is very much the woman we see in, in the Gospels who pondered um, God's Word in her heart. We know when she... Uh, saw the works of God and he heard the words of Jesus in Luke uh, chapter 2 verse 19 and, and, and also in 51 it says she pondered them in her heart and also the Magnificat that beautiful canticle she she quotes a whole bunch of scripture from for the, from the Old Testament um, we see in scripture that the Blessed Virgin Mary is very much a woman of the word. And in these apparitions in Argentina, again, that have just been approved by the church, uh, we see a dimension of the Blessed Virgin Mary that is, is, to me, absolutely wonderful, beautiful. I'm just loving uh, what I'm learning about Our Lady of the Rosary of St. Nicholas in Argentina. So, uh, so I, I encourage you, Brothers and sisters, learn about this apparition. I'm going to be giving a presentation on it at the Charismatic Center. I don't know when yet, uh, but I'll keep you posted.